Hi guys, Christina here. So today's video is gonna be another makeup product review. And as you can see, I'm wearing everything, like my makeup, but not wearing any lipstick because the product we're reviewing today are lip products. And these two lip products are from the brand Royal Beauty. So there you go. I bought these online because one of you guys recommended that I review this brand and I went online and checked out their makeup products and I basically got these two lip products to review. They actually have different type of makeup products like contour, powder, um, lip liner, eyeliner, brow products but I only got these two. Now, just quickly about the brand. The brand is for those who have sensitive skin because they're pure mineral makeup, so all natural, absolutely no chemicals, has sunscreen, they're made in Paris, France, and they're from the makers of Chanel. And it has antioxidants and paraben free so so far mukhang promising siya so far na try ko na tong lipstick nila i've posted this sa instagram this is the shade hope and the shade is parang brownish nude siya and i really like it for every day so here we go let me show you and i'll just quickly swatch it And then on my lips. So this is the shade Hope. I really like the packaging. It's like royal blue. The product itself is very creamy on my lips when you first apply it. Very moisturizing siya. It kept my lips moisturized the whole day. Although it's not long lasting kasi nung kumain ako medyo natanggal siya tapos I had to reapply. But I don't mind reapplying if ganito naman siya ka creamy and ka moisturizing. So yeah, so the lipstick I really like. Now, the other lip product I got is this matte lip gloss. So this is what we're gonna try today. I got the shade Real Nude RMLG06. So ito yung packaging niya. Blue din yung takip. And then this is how it looks. Ito yung applicator niya. Now let's swatch it. Mukhang very creamy naman siya. Now, on the lips naman, it feels very moussey. Parang it's not a lip gloss. Parang na rin siyang liquid lipstick. Very pigmented. You know? The shade is very orangey. Now, I just need to clean the sides and I'll come back. Right, so quickly lang before I go through my day. First impression on this lip gloss. It's very pigmented. Parang hindi siya lip gloss. It's ano, para siyang matte liquid lipstick. Very pigmented. Tingnan niyo yung color when you apply it. Diba? One swatch lang siya. Napakadaming product na. And the shade I picked is nude. This is real nude. But it appeared a bit dusty orangey siya sa lips ko. But I don't mind that. I am actually liking it. Kasi medyo kakaiba yung shade niya. And it tried totally matte. As you can see, sobrang matte na siya sa lips ko. And let's test lang kung transfer proof ba siya. So, walang anything. Nothing. There you go. Ayan o. Hindi siya nag-smudge. So, yeah. Now, um, the only thing that we need to test really is kung long-lasting ba siya sa lips. And if kumain ako ng something, matatanggal ba siya. I will be back in about 2 to 3 hours. And update you guys. See ya!
Hi guys, I'm back and it is now 7.03 in the evening. I applied this around 3.30 if I'm not mistaken. I wasn't able to show you guys the time when I applied this but it was around 3.30 to almost 4 o'clock in the afternoon. Now, let me just quickly zoom you in so you guys can see how it looks. There you go. So this is how it looks right now. It's been around three hours. So there you go. This is how it looks now. Actually, it's not as bad as I thought it would be because like dito sa labas, it's still intact except the inner part because I just had uh, merienda. I had taho and then I also had my dinner and it still held up pretty well kahit papano. And it didn't bleed like dito sa sides which is nice because some other like lip gloss or liquid lipsticks nagbo-bleed sila here. That's why yung ibang liquid lipsticks, they recommend using lip liners. But this one, kahit wala, I didn't use any lip liner and hindi naman siya nag-bleed because it dried instantly. Since kumain ako kanina, medyo nagka-crack na siya ng konti dito sa loob. The only thing about this lip gloss is it tend to feel a bit dry. Parang yung lips mo dry siya. Parang uhaw ka or something. Yung ganung feeling. But it's not really dry. It's only because nga yung formula niya is matte. Alright, so just a quick summary. In terms of pigmentation, both these two products are very pigmented. Even this one, tinawag na lang lip gloss. But I would say para na siyang liquid lipstick. Dahil sa pigmentation niya. This this lipstick is very creamy and moisturizing. Now, this lip gloss naman, because nga it's matte, flat na matte talaga yung itsura niya sa lips mo. The lipstick is not smudge proof or kiss proof, while the lip gloss is. Kahit na nirub ko na siya earlier, hindi pa rin siya talaga natatanggal. The only time na natanggal na siya would be when I ate something. So overall, I really like the lipstick. Ito talaga, I highly recommend it. The shade, the moisture that it gives the lips mo. Now, the lip gloss, I like it, but not as much as I like the lipstick. This one, it reminds me of the Ofra liquid lipstick, their collaboration with Kathleen Lights. This one, medyo similar sila in terms of shade. Darker lang itong sa Ofra, pero when you wear it, medyo lighter version ito nung Ofra na liquid lipstick. Miami Fever, yon. So, medyo similar yung shade. Alright, that's it guys. Thank you for watching. I hope you find this review helpful. If you did, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already. Bye!